What advice would you give to athletes keen to develop as leaders? Um, firstly, I would say that number one is for everyone to realise that they they are a leader. They can be a leader. There doesn't need to be a job title um, or a role, but you can lead. Um, so I think that's the the first one. Um, you know, you might not wear the armband, but or be a more experienced player, but you certainly can lead in your own way. Um, I think, secondly, I mean, I've learned loads from sort of psychologists, sports psychologists, using that reflective um, element and also speaking to your teammates and other athletes. Um, I'm really kind of, I guess, developing my skills that way. Um, also, I mean, we have a leadership group within our squad that we use um, to develop leaders. We've also um, got our, we've got within hockey our visions, values, and behaviours, and we have values groups. And within them, the kind of four or five women are in each one, and each one of them has a leadership role within that in terms of really pushing on projects in that area. Um, so we've tried to develop in our sport. At the same time, we've got athlete reps for the BAC um, that have a leadership role for their sport. Um, so there's various different elements, I think, and ways that you can develop those skills, both in sport and out of sport. Um, I also tend to read a lot, I guess, and talk to people and ask ask people different questions and kind of learn from those incredible athletes that have gone before me. Um, and I listen to podcasts and all different kind of things. I I just, I guess, want to learn as much as possible. So my advice to any athlete would be, one, to see yourself as a leader already, um, to use the support that you've got around you and speak and ask questions um, and also look for opportunities such as athlete rep reps um, or leadership groups within your own sport.